Moving on. 15-year-old Abdul Malik Oseni loves the world of science and technology. This passion led him to build a traffic light circuit. The young innovator who lives in the underserved community of Makoko in Lagos, Nigeria, believes that technology with quality education can help solve local and global challenges. Here's the story. 15-year-old Abdul Malik Oseni lives with his grandparents in the waterfront community of Makoko. When he's not in school, he's on his tablet trying to acquire more knowledge. Malik says he also likes to spend his free time drawing, painting and creating innovations. He has always had a flair for science and technology, especially coding, and seeks to provide solutions to problems in his immediate environment. One of the things I created, using cartons and Using cartons, glue, and stripes, that I, I created a national theater. And, and also, I also created, I, I also built a circuit, which is called the traffic light, which, which you can use to control the traffic light. This is the Arduino Nano. The, the Arduino Nano is, it, it is the brain of the circuit. And also, these are the, the LED light. Even though Abdul Malik lives in an underserved community, he believes that the right skill set that is technology driven, coupled with quality education, can provide opportunities for solutions to local and global challenges. As you know that our world is technology driven, having having an essential IT skills can can help and develop our world to a better place. Because education and ICT combined together, it, it can be used as a tool to, to reform our society and nation as a whole. Technology provides opportunities for learning and education, but in remote regions, several children miss out on such benefits as digital access creates a divide in line. But with children with such mindsets as Abdul Malik and opportunities provided by both government and non-governmental organizations, there could be hope for even the most disadvantaged children.